Hey everyone, welcome to Mix It Up Art. Today we are going to be painting a cute picture of a penguin. To get started, you're going to get a sheet of blue construction paper, and I want you to hold it portrait style so it's longer up and down than it is side to side. We're going to start with our white paint, and what we're going to do is just paint a big rainbow line on our paper. And I don't want to go all the way to the bottom because I want to leave room for his feet but I'm just gonna paint that rainbow line. And then once I'm done with that, I'm gonna fill in the inside of the rainbow line with this white. So I'll just draw a line here and then paint in the inside. Once I have this rainbow shape all filled in, I'm going to wash and dry my paintbrush. And now I'm gonna get some of my black paint and I'm gonna go around the outside, again with another rainbow line, but outside of the white. And I'm gonna go over it two times, again to make sure that I cover up all the paper space and I connect the black line to the white line. You wanna make sure there's no gaps in between the black and the white, so you shouldn't see the blue paper at all. If you do, just add in a little more black. Now we're going to add in his little wings. So we're gonna get some black paint and we're basically going to paint a sideways U. And then we'll just fill that in. And we're gonna do that for both sides. And now we're ready to add its eyes. So I'm gonna be using the back of my paintbrush for this. I'm just gonna dip it into the black paint and then I'm gonna add two dots. One, two for his eyes. And now again, I'm gonna wash and dry my paintbrush. So I need to make sure I clean off the back first and then wash the brush really well and dry it. Next, what I'm gonna do is add in his little beak. So I'm gonna be using the orange here. So I'm painting a triangle, kind of like an upside down triangle. So I'm gonna do a V first. And then I'm gonna fill it in, go across to make the triangle and then I'm gonna just fill it in. Finally, we're gonna add his little feet. So all we're gonna do for this is paint a little M for each one of his feet. All right, so we're almost done. The last thing that we're gonna do is add in a little scarf. So again, I'm gonna wash and dry my paintbrush and I'm gonna be using some pink for his scarf, but you can use any color. And I'm gonna go above his arms, but under his beak, and I'm just gonna paint a curved line. And then I'm gonna add in the two parts of the scarf that go down. So here, I'm just gonna come down, paint a line that goes off to the side, and then another line that goes straight down. And now all we're gonna do is add in a little bit of snow. So I'm gonna wash and dry my paintbrush. And here I'm gonna use the back of my paintbrush again. I'm gonna dip it in the white paint and I'm just gonna add little snowflakes all around my penguin just by dotting it on there. And as always, you can add as much or as little snowflakes as you want. The last step for this will be to clean off the back of your paintbrush and then add in a little bit of snow underneath of your penguin. So he needs to be standing on something. So all we're gonna do is just paint in a little bit of white snow underneath his feet here. And that's it. That's all there is to our cute winter penguin. I hope if you make these at home, you tweet me a picture at MixItUpArt, and as always, have fun.